Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. And if you are new, welcome. When I think of the winter months, all I think about is just keeping toasty and warm and just cozy. And I basically base my whole life around that. So I thought it'd be fun to share with you guys my top 10 cozy winter essentials. So in today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys my personal favorite things to keep cozy in the winter time. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the easiest one. It's actually what I'm wearing. So cozy essential number one would be a very, very warm, comfy, cozy winter sweater. This one in particular is from Primark and it was less than $20. It is so warm and it's like a really nice, soft knitted sweater. I chose white out of all the colors because it reminded me of snow and not to mention, it's just so easy to just throw on, walk out the door and you don't have to worry about like any crazy layering going on or getting cold at all. You just throw on a jacket and you're good to go. So essential number two, guys, this is a Bath and Body Works candle and it is in the scent spruce. And let me tell you something. This is the best candle, winter related candle, I've ever smelled in my entire life. Oh my God. If you guys have not smelled this smell before, you're missing out on life in general. Um, okay, not to mention, I mean, the obvious thing we're all thinking right now, dang, that's an aesthetic candle. I mean, you got the frosted glass, you got the rose gold top right here, because who doesn't love rose gold? And then you have this like vintage print pine on the front. I mean, like it's, it's the most beautiful candle I've ever seen in my life. Really, it is. And it's the best smelling candle I've ever smelled in my entire life. I honestly try to hold off on lighting this because I don't want it to be done. Like I want to keep it forever. Okay, so my third cozy essential would be cozy socks and slippers, without a doubt. You need something to keep your tootsies warm, okay? I don't know about you, even when my heat's on, the first thing to go ice cold on my body is my feet. Right now, I'm in the process of buying new slippers, but these are my slippers right now, and I got these actually from Sears. They were on clearance. This is from the brand Isotoner, and what I love is the faux fur lining around the ankle. These have a rubber sole, so you can wear them outside. These are like my slippers I wear around the house and outside because they keep my feet that warm. But I do want to get just a pair that I just keep inside. Cause it's kind of grimy that I walk around in these in our apartment and James always gets mad at me. He thinks I'm disgusting, which I don't blame him for that. Okay guys, so cozy essential number four is none other than, okay. I'm a huge hat lover guys. And when it comes to winter time, I will always, 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 always be in beanies, but not just any beanie, okay? If you want a cozy beanie, you gotta go with the pom-pom, okay? You need a pom-pom beanie. It's white with little gold speckles in it. I love it, it's just, oh, Christmas. Um, with a white pom-pom, and I actually got it from the Target dollar spot. It was $5 though, it wasn't a dollar. But um, yeah, great quality, super stretchy, will fit any size head. Yeah, um, this is all I wear in the winter time, guys. It is super warm. I mean, 80% of your body heat comes straight from your head. So if you just warm up your head, your whole body is just gonna love you. Cozy essential number five would have to be super warm gloves. <laughs> These are like my signature gloves when it comes to winter time. I like to be able to feel things. That, um, the beautiful thing though about this glove I love is that it can turn into a mitten. There you go. And then it just kind of buttons back here and then it doesn't go anywhere. It just stays put. Yeah, I kind of love it. Okay guys, so cozy essential number six, I think we're on, right? Six. Every single year I need a cozy, cozy, cozy winter mug. Right now I am rocking the gingerbread and I just bought a new one at Christmas tree shop, but this guy's my little friend because there's no better way to get cozy than to have a nice hot beverage. I drink it all, hot cocoa, coffee, hot tea. There's not a day that doesn't go by, especially in the winter where I don't drink 
hot beverages. So, and you just have to have it looking really super cute. It's gotta fit the season or else <laughs> why bother? Okay guys, so cozy essential number seven. This is huge. This is really big. I know what you're thinking. Okay, yeah, blanket. This is not just any blanket. It's a heated blanket. Because guys, I get so cold. I mean, it's kind of obvious, like everybody gets cold in the winter time. So my way of keeping warm other than bundling up is um, a heated blanket, okay? I could put my heat on, but I'm too cheap. I don't wanna put my heat on. I need to save on that bill. It's from the brand Sunbeam. They're very big. Everybody's probably heard of them. And yeah, and you could just put it on low, medium, or high, little controller here. Pretty sure, yes, this one's an auto off. After three hours, it goes off, so you don't burn yourself and you don't burn your house down. <laughs> this one's just a throw blanket, but you can get like a queen size, a king size. Obviously, it gets a little more pricey, but I've come to find, in all honesty, that all you do need is a throw. I mean, unless you're sharing it with somebody else, but I usually don't. So, cozy essential number eight are chunky scarves, okay? Chunky, chunky scarves. They're chunky. I have a lot of scarves. I have actually scarves for every single season, yes, including summer. That's how much I love scarves. Out of the um, mountain of scarves that live in my closet right now, I pulled out my top three for the winter. My first one that I, I just, I'm obsessed with, and you'll see why, it's an infinity scarf, and I actually got this from either Michaels or AC Moore, one of those craft stores, and it was like six or seven dollars, I was like, but what caught my eye about this was not only is it a very loose knit, which I like that, I like that look a lot, it's very pretty, it is like this cheery, bright red Christmas color and it's got this gold shimmery like yarn that's just intertwined and it just really just gives that little pop that I love. So yeah, this is more of like my holiday red. I wouldn't necessarily wear this in like January or February, but like November, December, yeah, I'm definitely wearing this. Okay, my next favorite one is actually from my father-in-law when he went to Paris. I got myself a freaking scarf from Paris, that's right. But it is a nice, heavy-duty, chunky, warm winter scarf, and I absolutely love the way it lays. It's like folded, and it looks like a nice, almost like a formal scarf. Me personally, since it is a gray scarf, and you do have um, like a silvery, black, shimmery yarn inside, like just intertwined in it, because of those colors, I always think of New Year's, New Year's Eve, I think of January, like the really deep cold months. And then scarf number three, I had to guys. I couldn't just pick one scarf to show you, no way. I mean, talk about cozy though. I'm pretty sure I got this at TJ Maxx. I went with a nice hunter green color because I mean, I wanted something that would match the season. It goes great with Christmas and Honestly, it's an earth tone, so I feel like it could go with a lot of things that I have in my closet. If it starts randomly snowing or raining, I mean, you could definitely do that. I've never done it. I've seen people do it. It's a good idea and you know it. Essential number nine would be a cozy, warm, fluffy bathrobe. I wear this. Dang, I wear this a lot. I am a lounger when it comes to winter time. Like I'm always in watching Christmas movies. I don't go nowhere. Like I'm just a homebody, like really. So this is actually from Walmart and I've had this for a couple of years now. They are awesome. They had a lot of colors and I went with the cheery red again because I just thought of, you know, the holiday season and I thought it'd be so cozy to just wear opening up presents on Christmas day. Super fuzzy, cozy, it is nice and thick. That's what I like, man. I don't like those flimsy little something or another's you put on and you're still freezing your bum off. This, you know, like you don't feel any cold. I could like walk outside and I'm good to go. Okay, there's actually two more things. So I wanted it to be top 10, but I really don't want to not include something. So I'm just gonna add them in both of them, all right? So essential number 10 would be um, Eskimo boots. Because guys, let me tell you something. 
it is, it's, it's a wonderful thing to dress up during the winter time, looking real, real nice and sophisticated and real dressed up. But 99% of the time, I am like just wanting to be as comfortable as I can. I will throw on a pair of Eskimo boots. These I actually got at a thrift store, but they are from the brand Sonoma, so that's Target. Guys, I'm just throwing it out there. These are ugh, heavy duty. You will not get any snow or rain in them. Trust me, I've walked in these in like a foot of snow. You, they're great, even right here. Like they do not soak in. The lining is amazing. You got the fur that just like stops any cold air from getting down under here. I mean, guys, when it's freezing cold out, like I can't wear any shoe but this. I'm not kidding. When it gets like those super cold temperatures, like I, I don't like not feeling my toes, man. I do not like that. My bonus is, um, oh, pea coats, trench coats. They are so cute and look so great. But if you're really looking to just stay warm, cozy, and practical, you cannot be a puffer jacket. I actually got this from Burlington Coat Factory. And if you guys have not been there, go check out Burlington Coat Factory. They are very reasonably priced. This I think was $60 and um, like retail, it's over a hundred. And it has a faux fur hood. Um, <laughs> it is insanely insulated and I'm pretty sure this is meant to be like a ski jacket. But me, somebody who's never ever skied in their life, that's definitely not what I'm using it for. I'm more of the like go make snow angels kind of person and I have made snow angels in this jacket and you don't feel cold. You just don't. It has an extended lining underneath it. Um, doesn't necessarily go all the way in, but right around the wrist and up, there's an extra lining that you can slip your thumb in. So it's just like easy. You can still touch things and it'll stay in place and it won't roll up on you and be annoying. This is from the brand Free Country and it's from their Power Down series and it is meant to endure like significantly cold weather. So guys, that was it. Those were my 10 cozy, 11 cozy <laughs> essentials. This is just what I love around this time of the year when it's a brick city outside and you don't want to freeze out there, okay? Or in here, you don't want to freeze it at all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys got some ideas or inspiration of your own. So yeah guys, if you have any questions about anything that I showed you, just comment down below and we can chat it up. And if you're not already subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button down below. I make new videos every single week, um, videos just like this, fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Like first thing in the morning, I just whip this thing on, go make myself some breakfast. I am just cozy as a clam.